The Library Committee is probably the committee that jump-started the formation of the Chesterfield Historical Society of Virginia because we had a museum society before 1981 and what we really needed was a place where people could do research on genealogy, on photos, on the incredible collection of books which we were, had already started accumulating. This is the foundation. The, the library is the foundation of all of that history of the county. Uh, and it's a living history. We are probably the repository of the largest single point in this country of Chesterfield County, Virginia history. It's here. This is the beginning of the, the beginning of America. The first successful colony that in the county was cut out of part of that territory. We had our very first library in the 1892 jail, which is right next door to the museum. And from there we moved into the courthouse, the 1917 courthouse, and we had our first bigger library there in what's now known as the robing rooms for the judges at the back. And then from there we moved to Castlewood, and from Castlewood we came here in 2013. And quite frankly, I'd like it here because with the stained glass windows, this is the best place for a library because it blocks out the UV light. This is a very active environment. People are in and out all day, even speaking with other volunteers. There is so much to learn, and uh, it's a fabulous way, especially for a newbie to the area, to really learn uh, not only the history, but to, to be acquainted with, with people. I used to come in and drop materials off that I was donating to the Historic Society, and Lise would always be very gracious and accept them. The next thing I knew, I was a volunteer because they needed somebody to fill in. I started doing an alternate Tuesday and was having a lot of fun doing it because not only do I come in and get to see all this historic bits and pieces, but my mother had been a volunteer here for years. And my mother worked on the vertical file, so I keep finding handwritten notes in the vertical file. I'm not reading them, I'm hearing my mother's voice when I, when I see them. Well, I've only been here a year, um, but it's, got, it's, it's one of the most exciting places that um, I've ever been at, and I thoroughly enjoy it. We have in the collection right now, we have over 25,000 items in our library collection. Every other committee comes to us and does its research here. <laughs> I mean, seriously, I mean, we have, we, we're the storehouse for all the other committees. And um, that's why it is important. And it's also important because it's constantly growing. It's important to the historical society. It's also important to the, the greater community. Um, if you don't know your past, you really can't help plan your future. What I'd like them to know is that we're here. I'd like them to know that we're open Monday through Friday from 10 to 4, but we are here as a service to the public. We are not a lending library. We are a research library, so the people must come here to do the work that they want to do. I answer the phone. Uh, we take down messages and try to get them to the right people. We direct people to um, other historic sites, when they come in and they're lost, we give them the map to the other things on the courthouse green. And we answer their questions and pull files and help them find their own history. Any visitor who comes in, uh, I will help them through their research, which can be very simple or it can be rather complex. As a library committee, we pull the items and the resources that they can do, use to do their own research right here in the library. You know, research requests come in here daily. Online, by phone, people walk in. They come from Tennessee, they come from Hawaii. They can't spend enough time here because we've got so much stuff for them. So they say, can I please hand this over to one of your researchers? They do research, they do accessioning, they do abstracting, they do indexing, they help the public. That's our first duty, always to help the public when you come through the front door. But every single library, committee person has a, a special project of their own. After I joined the committee personally, it was that um, I found the, uh, my husband, uh, his lineage uh, goes all the way back to um, a relative of Park Poindexter, whose picture is on the wall over there, and that was the most surprising thing. We need volunteers, we always need volunteers, there'll always be a place for you here. Um, and as we get to know you, we'll establish 
uh, a niche for you to flourish and, and go headlong into a passion that you may not know you have. It's any age. We have so many different aspects of the, of the library committee that interest different people. Some people like data entry. We're always looking for things like that. Some people like putting indexes together, indices together. We, we need people like that too. Others, like we have a, a volunteer who works here on Mondays, she is fascinated by old photographs, so she took over the entire photo collection. We have about 8,000 photographs here from tintypes to digital. I think you have to love to read, number one, but you also have to be the kind of person who likes a good mystery because in delving into people's backgrounds, whether or people's buildings and life here, um, there's quite a few mysteries to be found. If you're interested in history, that's, that's a plus. But if you're interested in being organized or just in research itself, then we would love to have you. People who are curious, curious about their own roots or the roots of the history of Chesterfield. I think if you have interest, um, there's a place for you. Many retirees are looking for something to do that is meaningful. Um, this is personally meaningful, professionally meaningful to me, and you can, you can give as much time as you want. You can be as active as you want. Come join us. We can use more help. It's a great place. It's a lot of fun, and it's, my wife thinks it's a very good um, pastime for me. <laughs> she knows where I am. <laughs>